so here let me just go here So these are actually duplicate records. Three zero four, three zero four, three zero six, three zero. These are duplicate records. I have to identify the duplicate records. So how do you identify the duplicate records? So you will use glide aggregate, and you can identify the duplicate records. So here, what you will do? You go here. So you will actually. Use variable dot group by group by group by with a number field. You underscore number. You will group by with a number field, right? So after that, you will actually get the count of number field. You will actually pass you underscore number. Okay. Mm, I want to also print. See, all the records has one, but 306 has four. 304 has two. With a 304 number, there are two records. With a 306 number, there are four records. So here, what I can do, I want to print the duplicate records, right? greater than one. Greater than one. So greater than one means all are one. All the numbers has only one, all the number has only one, one records. But for 306, there are four records. But for 302, there are two records. So more than one records, how, so what are the numbers? So gs.print. dot you underscore number so let me just run this fixed script so more than one so these are the two records which has more than one record with these numbers so for 304 there are actually more than one records with this number, there are more than one records. So 306 also more than one records. I have to delete, I have to delete the duplicate records. So to delete the records, do we have to use glide aggregate or do we have to use glide record? We have to use glide record, right? To do the crude operations. Delete is actually crude operation or not. So then what I will do? I will write again glide record inside this one. Inside this one, I will write again glide record here. Inside this, if where gr is equal to new glide record, so you will actually take this table name. Okay. So gr dot add query. 
so you are actually querying with the numbers duplicate numbers u underscore number comma so here this variable name dot u underscore number so here you are actually passing this number dynamically gr dot query Mm. gr dot delete record so this will actually delete the records fine so the problem is it will delete all the records all the records means with a 304 number there are two records right it will delete two records with a 306 there are four records right it will delete four records but my point is so with a 304 there are two records right one record should be deleted one record should be present so with the 304 there are four records right so one record should be present the rest of the three records should be deleted so if we use this script right this will delete all the four records all the two records for those numbers so what we have to do in this case to exclude one record, you have to use gr.next two times. Okay, we are, you have to use gr.next two times. Then you will actually exclude one record. So which one, which record exactly you have to exclude? Latest created record or oldest created record? So if you want to exclude latest created record, what you have to do, you have to use another function called gr dot order by descending order. So you will exclude the latest created record and delete the oldest record. Now I am going to execute the script. So once I execute the script, script is executed now you go to the garage issue table with the 304 there are two records right so there will be only one record present and with the 306 there are four records right there will be only one record present see with the 304 there is there is only one record with the 306 there is only one record so there is no there are no duplicate records now so that is how you will actually delete the duplicate records using glide aggregate and glide record both APIs.